Hi there, so in this video I'm going to show you how you can add your personal images as a widget or as a sticker and also how you can import your personal backgrounds. So there actually is an image widget you can add to your template. So if you search for images, um, you will see that there are two different kinds of uh, widgets showing up. So the online image and the personal image. So click on the personal image and then it will apply you a widget that is just empty like this. And then from here, you can scroll down in the settings and you will see a setting called image and then browse. Then click on browse and then it will pull you up your folder from your computer and you can add a JPEG or PNG or SVG file to Planify Pro. So here I have an image ready. So I will be importing this image uh, you see right here then click on open or add. It will take a few seconds to upload the image and I recommend you if you can to stay below two megabytes. Then once it's uploaded it will be added um, as the last image in your folder. So it's right here. Then click on it and it will apply this image um, to the widget you have selected. Then if you go all the way up again you have a setting where you can make the image bigger or smaller. You can um, rotate it. You can move it horizontally up or down um, like this. And if you want to reset all the settings, just click here on reset and you're back to how it was before. Then next, you can also add the image widget as a sticker. So if you go to sticker mode, you activate um, the ability to add stickers and drag any kind of images on the planner around. So once activated sticker mode, you will see this panel here. So it's divided into stickers and stickers is where all the graphics are. And then if you go to widgets, you see that um, here you have five widgets available you can add to the template, which can be dragged around freely. So if you add a personal image, this will show up. So click on it and then in the settings below, again, go to browse and then it will pull you up your personal folder from your computer. Then uh, import all the images you want to add. Then once they're uploaded, uh, you can insert your image. Just click on one, for example, this one here. And then you can resize it. You can make it bigger or smaller and you can drag it to any place on the template. So you can add images um, to your template both as a sticker or you can insert it into a widget like I have here. Now I will quickly show you how you can import your personal backgrounds. So let's go back to player mode and then click on pattern. And here's where you apply patterns to your template. And you can apply patterns as a full pattern, as a frame, as a border, as an outline, as a card, top card. And then these are all public backgrounds you see here. So if you go to the next tab, which is my background, you will be able to upload your own uh, backgrounds to Planify Pro. So here below, it will already pull you up what you've uploaded previously. And if you have an additional background you want to upload, click here where it says upload here on the browse button. And then I have a background prepared I want to upload, which is this grid background here. So select the background you want to upload, click on open, and then it will upload the background. It will take a few seconds. And once uploaded, it should be down here below. Then click on it to apply it. So again, you can apply it as a full background, as a frame, as a border, like this, as an outline or below and above. And this is how you can upload your own backgrounds and images. And if you have any questions, feel free to message me on Instagram or Facebook anytime and I will try to respond to your questions as quickly as I can. Thank you. Bye.